just what was today like for you to get out there in front of some fans and have the kind of practice you guys had it seemed to be pretty spirited and high energy yeah uh i would say today was probably one of our best practices that we've had energy wise and we were just kind of flowing from thing to thing to thing and i think it made it very game like for us especially having some people there maybe get the nerves out a little bit before we start our first game that sort of thing um but i thought we did a really good job keeping the energy up throughout the entire thing so. is that i mean that, you feel like that has been building though in practice do you feel like you i think it has yeah definitely has um but just having the scout event the scout even and then translating it to practice and then you have fans there it kind of was for, full circle moment mm -hmm. so it was nice it was nice to have i was kind of i loved having the people there it was fun <laughs> it was so much fun i've never played in front of um huge crowds before so i mean that's one thing why i'm excited to play at Mackey. Katie talked about you being a leader and the girls following you. What's your leadership style? Um, I'd say I do a lot of example, but over the years I've kind of been pushed into a more vocal role. So I try to balance it both ways. I try to up the talk as much as possible because um, I know some people on this team uh, don't talk as much right now and like we're still getting comfortable or still whatever and that's just the easiest way to communicate. Um, you get the point across. So yeah. Where did you, where did you see the strides made by the by Kendall and, and Lana, you mm -hmm. know, when they first got here to yeah. to where they are today? I would say they're a lot more vocal demanding ball and they're confident in themselves in that aspect of knowing that they can score and slowing down the pace, not rushing their shot, finishing at the rim with contact as well as being able to find the shooters if they're being doubled or whatnot on the outside. So it shows a very fast maturity for them, I'd say. How competitive are they in the weight room? <laughs> oh, <laughs> they give me a run for my money. <laughs> Listen, I try, I try. I try to push the weight as much as possible. Um, so that's the most realistic it'll be to a game. <laughs> and KP, every time, gives me a run for my money. Like, I, I'm, I'm trying to keep up with her. I'm trying to keep up with her. Lana's right there with us, so. It's fun. It's a fun atmosphere to be a part. Yeah. Just out to, you know, Katie also mentioned you and Ella have kind of emerged as those mm -hmm. leaders, but it, it, she said some of it is you guys are trying to prove something too that you can play at this level. That, how do you, how do you, chant, uh, funnel all that into into what you want to do on game day? Um, I think. It starts in practice with demanding a lot from yourself and then others will follow you from that and they'll start demanding more of themselves. So then as a team we just kind of grow in that aspect and it'll show on game day that since we didn't take reps off in practice, we didn't go easy in practice, we didn't walk through anything, um, our intensity is just more there during games and right from the jump. So. You mentioned this was your, you know, playing in front of a a large crowd for the first yeah. time. What was your first fan day experience like overall? It was fun. I liked it. I enjoyed it a lot. Um, interacting with all the parents and all the fans and the little kids are always adorable asking for pictures and being like, oh my gosh, I always get the, you look like Caitlin Clark. <laughs> so <laughs> it's just fun to interact with them and it really makes you feel part of the community. What, what do you think Des has added Des? to this group? Des is fun. Des is fun. She, you wouldn't expect her. I don't know if wouldn't expect is the right word to say. Um, I don't know. She just goes out, goes out there and does what she needs to do. It's, it's not something you need to try and get out of her. It's always there every single day. She's just looking to have fun, um, looking to compete. I mean, you saw her pressure on the ball during practice. That's great for us. Um, she just has that kind of. I don't know how to say like undercover, like secret, you know what I mean? Like secret weapon sort of thing is what I would say. Kind of always there, but you know, she knows when to, when to let it, let it fly from the three point line. So we love her for that. Yeah.